What's going on guys, Bob Roach from RoachTechnology.com here with the first unboxing video of what will be a Hackintosh Beast. As you can see right here, which is what this particular video is going to be about, we have two Xeon processors. These are X5650s. These are uh, six core processors, 2.66 gigahertz. So I'll go ahead and I'll zoom in on the box a little bit here. So we have, uh, you know, Xeon 5600 series. On the side here, right here, is where you can actually see uh, more of those details of the CPU. So you see 2.66 gigahertz, uh, six cores, all those goodies there. And so in this video, we're just gonna be unboxing the processors. And the next video that you guys are gonna see on my channel is gonna be the unboxing of this guy right here. This is a dual CPU motherboard, the SR2. Uh, it is Hackintosh compatible. From what I've read, there I think there are you know a couple little quirks in installing it, you know, getting uh, Mac OS 10 running on it fully but it's nothing that's too complicated and surely nothing that me and the rest of you guys, the Hackintosh community as a whole, can't handle. So like I said, this video is just gonna be the unboxing of these guys, which personally, I don't think is gonna be anything too interesting, but I'm sure it's something you guys wanna see nonetheless. And like I said, next video will be the unboxing of this guy right here. So let's go ahead and get started with the unboxing of the Xeon X5650 six core processors. So here we have the Xeon Brothers, and for the purpose of this video, because these boxes are indeed identical, this brother here, he's going to go play some sports or build his own computer or something, and we'll just be focusing on this processor for the video. So getting a little bit more up close and personal, here we have the Intel Xeon processor 5600 series. This message here is very important because this processor does not come with any kind of thermal paste or CPU cooler, which if you're going to drop this much money on a system, you should know by now that that will kill your machine if you try to you know let it run without a cooler. In most cases, it should just shut down on its own, but regardless, it's not good for it. So you do need to invest in a third-party cooler if you're going to be going with the Z on here. Moving over here, getting a little bit more in-depth with the specs. 2.66 gigahertz Intel uh, Xeon X5650. This is a six core processor, uh, right, right there, processor. Once again, the model number. I'm not gonna get too much into this processor, you know, in terms of specs, because you guys just wanna see me unbox it. So we do have the Hackintosh juice knife here, which I thought was pretty um, proper for the occasion, if you wanna go ahead and say that. So we'll go ahead and stick the knife in here, go ahead and cut that tape, and do something like that. And here we have some cardboard, much like you would expect. And taking that out, we do indeed have a Intel, like a manual for the processor, which I'm sure I'm gonna read every single page of, but there is a sticker on the back if you wanna go ahead and throw that on your case, it's always nice. And here's the processor itself. So let's see how this even comes out of here. Much like that. And here you go. Now this processor is a little bit bigger than most just because it's a 1366. Actually, I shouldn't say most. It's gonna be bigger than your 1155, 1156. Uh, not bigger than your 2011 though. You know, it just kind of goes up linearly with the actual number of the processor. But regardless, I'm not gonna open this just because I don't wanna touch it if unnecessary. But I mean, that's the processor, not too complicated there. And very simple box. Like I said, there's nothing else in here. There's no cooling solution, nothing like that. So if you buy a Xeon uh, processor for your build, just be aware that you're probably gonna want to. And if for some reason yours does come with some kind of a cooler, you're probably gonna wanna go aftermarket anyway. Uh, but there you guys go. That's the unboxing of the Xeon processor. Once again, this this build will be housing two with the motherboard right back here. So go ahead and stay tuned to my channel for that. That is the EVGA SR2. Thank you for watching. I'm at CPU Kid on Twitter. Also, be sure to check out RoachTechnology.com and at RoachTechnology on Twitter. Farewell to the Xeon Brothers for now, and I'll see you guys in my next video.